Welcome to your inspirational astrology horoscope for Monday, August 20th, 2012. I am astrologer David Palmer, here to illuminate the collective consciousness. We have a huge week, lots of intensity coming our way at the end of the week. Mars going into Scorpio by the end of the week. We got the sun moving into Virgo this week, and we have Mercury returning home to the place it went retrograde to push forward and go faster back to normal speed. And this means a lot of intensity, but most importantly, we need to start with Monday. We are wrapping up the Sun and Leo. We have a couple days left here of our expression, of our core, really lighting up. What inspires us in our life? Why do we love? What is it that we love? How do we want to express our love? And you know what? Relationships are another part. That's because the moon, of course, in Libra today, and it is hanging out there with Mars and Saturn. Mars and Saturn and the moon in Libra. Woo! All right. Let's be honest, folks. When it comes to our partnerships, when it comes to the harmonious part of our life, we're fighting for it right now, right? We are all fighting for this balanced place, this harmonious place, for our partnerships to truly work out, for it all to work out, right? Yet, Mars and Saturn. Mars and Saturn met up all week, right? It was about pushing forward through any barriers in our life, any restriction, just wanting to blow through the doors. Unfortunately, though, and really, actually, let's erase unfortunately, it's all about Mars wants to fight. Mars wants to go forward and push through anything. Yet, it's so interesting that it's in Libra. Mars is ruled by Aries, which is, Aries is opposite of Libra. It is all about that non-action. So even though as we have this desire to fight, it's a peaceful way. We're looking for peace. We're looking for peace in our partnerships. We're looking for peace here. And emotionally, we're going to tap into that peace today. We want peace. It's connected up to our minds. It's connected to Mercury today. It's like, we want peace of mind in our heart as well. We want this peace of mind today. We want to express love, yet the moon in Libra today is going to also make a square to Venus and a square to Pluto, which means that new safe place that we really want in our partnerships, where we feel secure right now, will emotionally be tested. So if you're not feeling safe and secure, especially in partnerships or where you feel valuable, you will be tested here today. So stay in the love, stay in the peace. Also, you'll be tested today with Pluto. Yes, we want a new structure in our life. We don't want rules. We don't want the same control system. Guess what? The moon will make a test to that today. And really, we have an outlet out. That is because the moon will trine over to Jupiter, which means the way out is to see the big picture, to have the right attitude, to see the truth. The truth of, the, of our life is that we want love, we want peace, and we want them to come together. This is where the energy is at right now. And in order to do that, we must let go of our old system, let go of the control, let go of the rules that hold you back from that. You'll find the truth in that. Let go of the rules that restrict you from literally coming into this love and peace. Also, Venus and Cancer. You know, in order for us to feel safe and secure in our life, in order for us to really feel this homey place, we do have to value ourselves. And you know what? Venus was in this intense T-square, which means we have to find our unique self, which we really need to tap into our unique self and let go. Let go of the old. And to find peace, it truly is about shedding all this stuff up and rising above with the right attitude. At the end of the day, peace is here for us when we have the right attitude that peace is here. We don't wrap ourselves up. And if we feel safe enough, or if we feel controlled, or if we feel restricted, we want to fight through. It's not about fighting through at the end of the day. It's all about finding peace. It's all about having a plan for peace. It's all about understanding that our heart truly wants peace. And that our heart is what delivers the peace. And that is where it's at. Mars and the Sun are in a perfect sextile. And it's time to act on peace. It's time to connect that with our heart. It's time to connect that with what inspires us, with where we feel true to our core, where our, our expression is about what inspires us. When you express yourself by inspiration, you're living the life of love. When you express yourself by what your true heart's desire is, and that nothing comes between that, not your mind, not anything else, just pure love. And in order for us to do that and to find peace, you have to be in true love. And you're wrapping up your mind right now too with Mercury hitting the place where it went retrograde. Our attitudes must be on our heart and it must all connect. Go to my website. I'm here for you, david-palmer.com. If you want a one-on-one -on -one session, have me come in there and look at your life and find all that inspiration and get you on your path. Hit me up for a reading. You can click up at the store and I have my Astro Coaching where you can get me one-on-one -on -one every day for four weeks. 
Imagine waking up every morning and it's all about you and what's going on in your life. I am here for you. Check me out on my website, david-palmer.com. I'll see you guys tomorrow.